And I think people that play the D1 level need to share with kids nowadays these these experiences so they know, like, hey, it's not all the March Madness highlights you see uh, come tournament time. Like, it's a grind, not just during the season, but in the off season as well. And, you know, you went from, you know, playing in D1 program and becoming a D1 assistant coach for a long time. Talk to me about that. It was just that wake-up call that, you know, this thing never shuts off. I mean, there's no... There's no possessions off. There's no days off. There's no practices off. Um, so I think the biggest thing, and I'm sure you've heard this from a lot of players and coaches, you know, not to sound cliche, but it's just making the mental, emotional uh, adjustment. You know, a lot of people talk about the game, the speed of the game and the strength of the game. I think that has a lot to do with, you know, who you're, you know, specifically who you're referring to. I mean, I think some kids are college ready coming out, especially coming out of prep school. But I think you can't avoid the mental and emotional, the mind-body adjustment uh, that you have to go to when you um, start to face the highest level, you know, of anything you do, but certainly relative to what we're talking about, college basketball. And, that, and that's the thing that is most, um, you know, I think, emphasized when you go to, you know, Division One. 